With all the tension this week building in North Korea and the threats that Kim Jong-un will shoot missiles at U.S. targets, We Are Top Story decided to take this story on head on. So ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the North Korean Missile! <laughs> Funny missile. Well, actually, in this scenario, I would be the one exploding, so it's okay if I joke about it. Really? Thank you. <laughs> I may have to do this one standing, Phil. <laughs> really? No, nope, we're good. You're good? We're okay. okay. That's great. We're doing great. <laughs> Is that, that comfortable? So, uh, missile, yep. I have to say, I'm a little unsettled that you made it all the way here from, Korea, from North Korea on your own. Oh, well, settle that tummy, Philip. Don't worry about me. I flew coach. And this time of year, flying from North Korea is very affordable. Wait, you're a missile. You, you didn't fly here on your own? Well, Philip, I don't have a private jet like some people. Okay, <laughs> I do not have a private jet. Well, it's important that everyone knows that I fly coach, that I'm a humble, down-to-earth missile, unlike... <laughs> Some people. Okay, <laughs> you don't know anything about me, Mr. Philip, your favorite movie is Smokey and the Bandit. You know one thing about me, Mr. Ah, yeah. Look, so let's, just, let's just get this on. Let me just rephrase this to get us back on track. Okay. How far can you travel on your own? On my own, way? according to my Nike Sprint app, about five to six miles on a brisk jog. That's not accounting for uphill or if I run into any jungle cat or orphans. Okay, wait, 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 wait. wait I'm, I'm jogging. I'm talking about flying. You're a missile. Right. Are you saying all missiles fly, Philip? I'm saying that all missiles fly. That's, that's generally what a missile that's is. That's a stereotype, and you are bordering on hate speech right now, okay? <laughs> no, I'm not. You're a missile, they fly. Just tell me how far can you fly North Korean missile? 50 yards. <laughs> Only 50 yards? Well, I measured when it was cold, so it's going to be that shorter. That has nothing to do with it! <laughs> that has nothing to do with it! Philip, you don't know what it's like. Being a nuclear missile in North Korea, there's no internet. I get on my chat rooms trying to contact other weak, long-range nuclear missiles, but there's no connection. I'm just tap, tap, tapping on Microsoft Word. There's no one there. You know what I wish, Philip? You know what I wish every day of my miserable missile life? I wish I could turn this missile on myself and launch myself into me. <laughs> North Korean missile, I didn't know you had it so bad. I'm, I, I'm really sorry. And it's okay. I appreciate you coming to the show. And you know what? Since you made an effort, I'll make an effort too. If, if, if you need somebody, North Korean missile, I'll, I'll be there for you. You mean it? I yeah. can stay with you? Well, I, sure, I guess you can stay with me. And you live close to the target area? I what? mean, Los Angeles? <laughs> I live in Burbank. Oh, the valley? <laughs> Boom! I got you again, Philip. I'm a bastard. You bastard North Korean missile, everybody. Let's hear it for it. Now let's boo him. Let's boo the North Korean missile. Thank you. He's a North Korean missile. He's sympathetic, but he's still evil. And finally, Annette Funicello from the original Mickey Mouse Club has died at age 70. Annette's final words were, M-I-C, oh. see you real soon, Frankie Avalon. 